Hey guys, this is Steven, and today I'm going to be showing you how to add two different colors to the same 3D text object in Cinema 4D. Let's get started. We're going to be making something like this, with a color of your choice on the inside of the text, and a color of your choice on the outside of text. So, let's just delete this layer, and do it again. I already have my material selected, I made a nice blue with a little bit of reflectiveness, and I made a white with a little bit of reflectiveness too. So we're going to go to MoGraph, Mo Text, and I'm just going to type in CC, whoops, CCMM, and I'm going to choose the font Batman Forever, because it looks pretty cool. I'm going to change the depth to around 100, because I just like it sort of thick, because it's, you know, 3D text. And we're going to go over here to the Caps tab. And where it says Start Cap, go down to Fill It Cap. And at the end, do the same thing. You can also mess with the radius, the, or the radii, or whatever. And you can bump these up to however much you want. Whoops. So it has a more bulkiness to it. I don't know, I just like doing it like that because it looks pretty cool. Alright, so now, once you have this, and you have your materials, just drag one, and then drag the other on top of it. And make sure the material that you want facing on the outside face of the text, like where you're going to look at it, is on the outside. So I want the blue to be in the middle. So I'm going to take this and just drag it, move it over there on the outside. Now, as that's selected, I'm going to go down here to Selection, and hold Shift, and type C, and then a 1. And then hit Enter. And what that'll do, that'll put the white on the outside, and the blue on the inside. Unfortunately, for the back of the text, it's not going to really show up. But for the front of the text, it's right there, and it looks pretty darn cool. Now, actually, if you wanted the back of the text, all you'd have to do is type in C2, like this, and it will show up on the back. I'm not familiar with any other ways in which you can put it, but if you want it on the front, all you need to do is put C1, Enter, and there you go. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you haven't already, checked out our website, go ahead and do so. The link will be in the description. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Tell us how we're doing. Subscribe. See you later.